today's video, we are going to be testing the sauna tent. This is a portable sauna that's supposed to be cheaper than anything else out there. So we're gonna see, is this thing actually legit? I'll show you what's included in the box, the setup process, and the entire experience. So let's do it. First thing we need to do is pick up some wood. So let's go to the grocery store. We need a lighter, we need tinder, and not the app, and wood. I'm just gonna through these. I think that's it. The wood acquired. So we got some like uh, healthy wood, I guess. It's like one piece, but sweat tents that they're starting like a delivery service where you can get a subscription of wood to your house, which is pretty nice. Um, but I guess they don't have wood here in the summer. It's only in the winter where you can go to the grocery store and buy wood at the grocery store. So I guess the option is buy it online, Home Depot or a nearby grocery store. All right, here I've got Danny Kabuni, Kabuni Danny. Hey. And he's gonna help me set up the sweat tent today. So, okay, so this is what this is. It's like a pop-up tent? A pop-up sauna tent. Oh, so you can go camping like this? Yeah. You, technically you could, you could take this with you. Is it electric or is it? It is not electric. Oh. Burn fire in the stove. <laughs> We're gonna make a sauna outside. Oh man, I'm so excited. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, I'm ready to sweat everything out. Exactly. Yeah. That's what we need to figure out how to do this. There's a plethora of instructions. How to use your sweat tent. You have to actually season the stove, but we're gonna skip that even though it says do not skip. User warnings, sweat tent manual, and watch your setup videos here. This goes in there. Like that? Yeah. I think it's a bit taller. So in this is the stove and inside. Oh, oh, there's a screwdriver. We needed this. Oh, and the thing to pick the wood at? One, two, three. Four. And then this goes right here and you lock it. Yeah. Oh my God, it's so tall. Okay, I think this is for the door. Are these like the door handles? Oh, I got it, look. Oh, is that where the wood like goes? Right here, look, it goes right there. Oh, right here, okay. Yeah. The wood goes in there. It's oh, there's the a piece one. right here. Oh. oh my God, this is real life. What is this, the ashtray? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then there's a, there's a rocks tray. Does this just go on top? This is what would heat it. Oh, we need to get the legs out. Oh, yeah. Yeah, how do you oh, do it? That's so easy, look at that. Boom. Okay, okay. How is this gonna be, like, is this not gonna blow out out of the wind or something? That's why this is here, look. Should we season it? Yeah, we should. Yeah, let's season it. Okay, so what we need is jackets, probably. <laughs> to do that part, though, we need a lighter, uh, at-home, on-the-go wood fire starter, Duraflame, fast lighting, Burns up to three hours. That's all you got? No, but I think it's like a special fire. What is it, like a New York firewood log? <laughs> oh, look, there's pictures. Oh, oh, oh my God. I think we should just set it up. Yeah. <laughs> and, then, and then season it while it's set up. No, nighttime sauna? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is ready. If you do plan to buy a sauna tent, use discount code SHERVIN and click the affiliate link down below. It is at no cost to you and helps support the channel so we can keep making videos like this. So when you buy a sweat tent, what comes with it? You're gonna get the sweat tent device itself. Uh, this is the bench. We did have to assemble this together. It came kind of flat. And then we had to put this piece together as well. You had to assemble that, that came flat and this all came inside of the chimney. You do have to pay extra for the uh, ladle and the devices in here. There's actually a sauna hat too. You can wear this thermometer. Sauna hat, torch lighter. Oh, we didn't need a lighter. Um, and then a little baggie, I think. You wanna open this? Yeah. Y'all excited, I don't know what this is for. Eucalyptus essential oil and a screw. So the first thing we do is set this up, then we're gonna put the chimney in, and then we're gonna turn it all on. I think the question is, as we set this up, we need to understand how we do it, just in case we need, we need to tear it down. How do you repackage it? Buy something and you open it, then you can never get it in the bag again. Oh! Oh, wow. So now we can take this out. Don't need that. See, it's like already. And now we have to erect it. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Okay. That one's good. This one's good. Oh, we're in business. Yeah? Oh yeah, look. This one's good. Oh, this is like we're going camping. Oh! oh all right. Oh wait, we gotta do the top. Oh my God, this is real. What have we done? It's warm. It's warm? Bro, we can go camping in here. Wow, this is really cool. It's warm, right? Wait, and there should be windows. Oh, do you take it off entirely? No, you roll it up. Oh. 
Oh my God. Whoa, it comes off? What was that? Oh, that's the chimney. Yeah. Okay. Put these over here. That's for the chimney. Oh. We got two boxes that are unopened. What do you think yours is? Thermometer, sauna thermometer. Oh wow, this is really nice. Comes with wooden screws. How are we gonna install this? Humidity, temperature. No Celsius, this is truly American made, huh? Whoa, what is that? Oh, it's to protect it from the rain. I think that's if you want to keep it long term, you'd use that. Dude, this thing is so big. Okay, so now we gotta put the chimney in. All right, let's take the big devices inside. So this bench is supposed to go inside. You wanna go inside? Yeah. All right. All right, you wanna bring that in? Here, I'll just pass it. Bring this in. Whoa, right. stick it through. Oh, it's the entire thing. It worked, I think. You're renting this out for another room. <laughs> we gotta wash the rocks. I don't think you need the gloves for that. Let's, okay, I'll turn on the hose, full blast. Okay. You ready? I love how you have the oven mitts on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we put the rocks in there. Careful, they're hot. So make sure you wear your gloves. And then, boom. Now, you take this inside, and we actually have to put this on top, I think, right? Because the tray will heat this up. Okay, so we're gonna put the log in, and we're gonna season it. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> the seasoning, bro. So what we're gonna do now is we'll light this side and then you'll slide it in and then I'll light the other side. Okay, I think we're good, right? Is there anything else we're supposed to do? And then what, we just close this door or we let it burn? Oh, really? Oh, it's subtle, it's subtle. <laughs> okay, that's good. It smells like fire now. Is that bad? Pops and crackles coming from the stove. The stove will start to change color. Do not worry, this is normal and part of the seasoning process. Let it run until it burnt out and then you can move it into your tent. Open the control vent on the stove. Where's the control vent? The control vent? Oh, yeah. is, oh, oh is that the bottom? Oh. Uh-oh. So I think we have to unscrew this. Oh, you did it, you did it. Oh. You did it. Oh, how'd you do it? It did. Is that right? It's warm. Oh God, all right. Now we just can just leave it. Oh, I can smell the chemicals. Yeah, right? I'm getting lightheaded. <laughs> okay. Yeah, got a bunch of bozos doing a little fire. Looks like uh, burning man out back there. <laughs> it's, yeah, so right now it's getting pretty warm. I would assume that this metal is gonna be really warm. It is very smoky outside, so that is not ideal because now our neighbor has already complained. I'm not complaining, but he's like, yo, what's going on? I'm gonna close my windows. What type of wood we're using? Maybe it's the type of wood we're using. I don't know, we did something wrong, but we're gonna let this keep burning. Oh my God. I think we need to let it like season, no? This is seasoned, we did it. It's been sure? Right. It's 20, did it say season for 20 minutes? Yeah. That's it? Yeah. Okay, then put the rocks on it. Know. Do you need the gloves? All right, let's go outside. Ugh. <laughs> The seasoning is supposed to like just heat up the metal so it like burns the chemicals off. Right. And then I'm hoping the smoke will stop. So you just, that the heat stays in there? I wanna wait for the I was smoke like, where's the stop. heat source coming from? Won't the smoke stop when it's like burning uh, in the right way? Yeah, definitely cozy up there. Damn, I'm getting a headache low key. Uh, it says we, li we probably started it wrong. <laughs> yeah, cause you opened it, remember? Yeah. It's okay, everybody makes mistakes. Can you open the, the cover so more air goes in? Yeah, whatever you want. <gasps> yeah, yeah, do that. <gasps> it's getting a little better for sure. So we're gonna do a little tour and show you what the sweat tent is like overall. Ideally, the first thing when you get it, what do they say to put down here? Anchors. Anchors, we didn't do that. You can like put it in dirt or whatever or put like heavy objects. We didn't do that. Or you could put a Shervin. Or a Shervin. And then it's got a door right here with the sweat tent logo. The door is a bit small. It's a bit hard to climb in. It is, but I appreciate it because when you open it, it doesn't let so much of the heat out. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. You're right. You just got to make sure when you step, I think the hardest part was putting the bench and the oven in there. True. So not, not the most ideal experience, but 
Yeah, I guess you're right. And then it's got Velcro here, so you can Velcro it to keep it open if you need. Like right now, we're kind of just venting it. We're seasoning it the wrong way, that's for sure. We didn't have enough time. And then these are the doors that helps prop it up when we're done. Yep. It's got massive windows and it's got Velcro here. Uh, we took the windows off and tossed them to the side, but you can put them back on if you need. And this is what keeps it upright and sturdy. So we had to pull these apart to kind of get it all the way into its pieces. And then if you come around here, you can see how big the massive windows. It's on what? So big. One third of it is yeah. windows. <laughs> come on into our crib. Now, there's no flooring, so be prepared wherever you put it. There's no flooring. It's whatever cold. floor you put it on. The floor is cold. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so we have a cold floor. And then here we've got rocks, so we can pour water on the rocks to get it heated. Uh, obviously, the oven is wood fired, so we don't need to plug it in or anything. And there's a chimney, which is going to emit a lot of smoke. There's a thermometer that comes in, uh, and you can put this up on the wall. So we could probably fit three people. You'd be a little squished. Two people relaxed, really for sure. Yeah. And then you could fit another bench there if you wanted to. Uh, if we need to put wood in, that's how you put the wood in and everything and then you can go ahead and close it lock this down this is to vent the air so it gets more oxygen it just burns faster so i think this is like a great starter sauna if you want to start saunaing but you don't have uh you don't want to invest like five thousand dollars and you don't have a permanent space this is like a good temporary how much is this this is like a thousand dollars you just have to buy wood every time you want to do it and it takes about 30 minutes to heat up it, what, what's the temperature outside it's currently 40 degrees but it was quick. Though. Fahrenheit. Remember when we were like setting it yeah. up? It was just like instant hot. It was. And this is, I think, pretty hot too. All right, this is 70 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's see if this gets warmer in 30 minutes. Uh, we're, set, we're at 68. 60, so it's getting colder? Yeah. 68 degrees. And it is 443. But it's way colder out here. Out here, it's like 30 degrees. Yeah, it's getting colder outside for sure. Yeah, it's colder outside for sure. Zipper here has like a little cover to cover it, which is nice. But then it's also hard to find the zipper. We can open it up, go inside. Oh, what's up guys? What's up? Welcome to my Airbnb. We're in here with all our jackets on. <laughs> but do you think it's gonna match the temperature? It's gonna be a little tough. I'm not yeah. gonna lie, yeah, because how cold it is. It said 200 degrees within 30 minutes. Fahrenheit. Oh, look at that. Wow. Wow. Okay, you can see. 302 degrees, it says. Yeah, so now we can see where the gaps are. So there's a vent right there, and that's gonna be dissipating some heat. And then the windows, obviously, are dissipating a lot of heat. Really? Yeah. So you can cover the windows up. Oh, should we cover them? Yeah. It's now at 60 degrees, so it's gotten colder. It's been about 30 minutes. What happened? I don't know. I, I don't know if it's because the, there's air coming in from underneath these. Yeah, because the floor is vented. There's like little holes in there. Cool. Yeah. The floor, my feet are freezing right now. Yeah, but then even above here, it's it's really warm. Yeah. It rises, obviously. So. We, we did move the thermometer from up there down, so that could have been one reason. Oh, it just that's it. It just went back up. So it hasn't gotten any warmer. It stayed the same temperature this entire time. Yeah. So we just put the thermometer up, and now it's at 70 degrees Fahrenheit. Depends on where you put the thermometer. If it's up there, it's 70. If it's down there, it's 50. As a market of measure, it is 38 degrees Fahrenheit outside. So it's almost freezing, um, but that's definitely gonna make it harder for this thing to heat up in the cold outside right now. So something to keep in mind. Oh, what have you brought for us? Uh, a bucket of water from the stream outside. The stream, the river? Yeah. It's fresh water, huh? Got some hot water. So we got a ladle. Is this a bucket or a ladle? Uh, this is a ladle. That's what's called a ladle? Such a funny word. Right? This is a ladle. ladle. Yeah, right? This water is currently 100 degrees. It is warm water. All right. So you're, now you're going to pour it on the rocks? Yeah. Oh. I can see through the thermal camera the water like spreading out. <laughs> <Really? laughs> yeah. Like you see that right there and on the floor? <laughs> that's from the water like popping off. Whoa. Oh. Oh my god. Steamy. Oh yeah, it is getting steamy. Yeah. I can feel it. Still not enough to get naked though. No. <laughs> Come on in. What's out? That's the... The sauna tent. What do you think? Crazy. Does crazy. it? Should we go inside? Inside the sauna? Yeah, you gotta see the inside. Do you see that? Alright, you ready? Um, 
<laughs> go, go, go. It's gonna get, oh, it's so steamy. Get in, get in. Get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. Get in. Dude, my glasses got all steamy. <laughs> really? Yeah, look. So it is humid in here, huh? Wow. I feel like this is great. I want one of these. This is a very interesting vibe. It is. Yeah. Right. Is it warm in here? It's warm. Don't you feel like you're camping? Yeah, kind of. Ah, all see? Together. You're not in New York anymore. I feel like I left New York. It's a cabin. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. There is a cleaning fee, so I just make sure to pay that on the way out. Okay. We just put water on the rocks and the humidity obviously increased. So what do the, what do the walls feel like? They're a little moist. Yeah, they're a little moist. You can feel the water on the walls. Okay, so it's been an hour <laughs> and we're still wearing our jackets. We added in the fire starter, but it hasn't gotten any warmer. I guess I'm glad you burst started burning that too. I think if we come back and we try it with regular wood, instead of this like It'll be fine. smart log that you bought. Uh, yeah. For some reason, I feel like it's not. Let's get your better health therapist on the line. Um, if you're not using better health. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair though, it was way hotter when we started it. Okay. Right? I had to walk, I had yeah. to get out. It was I think it's like, I think it's like slowly cooling Where off. Where's the heat coming from? The Where's piece of wood. From this. From the bottom? From this. Like this entire thing is supposed to be like a heating out like okay. source. Yeah. yeah. That's why this goes on top and then it's supposed to heat up the rocks. And then it's supposed to heat that thing up. All right, so it is day two with the sauna tent, and now we're actually going to take it apart. So I'll show you what that experience is like, how much effort it is to kind of put it back together and put it away. Um, I'm hoping it's not too difficult, but we had to take all this stuff out, as you can see here. It's officially seasoned, as you can see. It's slightly changed color. Um, so that's just going to happen when you season it. And then the tubing here is also a slightly different color, but the rocks and that tray has not changed. So in there, there is some ash. Uh, as you can see from the from the firewood, so we got to clean that up, <coughs> um, and it's gonna kind of look like this now so after it's been used. <coughs> That's something to keep in mind. So the chimney here, as you can see, has also been. Uh, kind of black in there. So that's gonna happen to the top of the chimney. And if you kind of look down. Clean the inside. Is that fit? Oh, oh, there we go. I love it, but not for sauna purposes. I think this is a great cozy tent that has the nice little, uh, what do you call it, furnace? Yeah. yeah, the furnace, I think it's cozy. I would take this camping to sleep in and not to sauna in. That's it. It was nice. You, we were inside and it felt like you were in a whole other world. It was, I loved it. Since you enjoyed this video, go watch my review of all the different kinds of ice baths and saunas. It'll be linked right here. I have a ton of health and fitness content. Turn on your notifications, subscribe to see future videos, and follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and X at Sherman Shares and Strava as well. Bye! <laughs> Peace.